Brandon. Don't f with me. No, 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 Brandon, 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 Brandon. Brandon. What? Brandon, let's just, let's just go. Watch it, what? Brandon. Go in front of me, go in front of me. Brandon. What? When you are talking about the sign, there was something in the corner, like a hand. Don't I'm not even kidding, Brandon. Okay guys, hey, I usually don't start my videos like this, but I needed a quick intermission before you guys watch this video so that you guys can understand something. The place that we went tonight was one of the most haunted places that we have ever been in. You could feel just negative energy in this place. You smell sulfur as soon as you walked in. It was honestly just a bad place to be. And when we were watching this footage back, we've noticed that the audio was completely ruined, completely shot. I'm trying to edit around it so you guys can like still get the feeling of what this place was like, but please forgive me and just kind of get through it. I'm gonna let you guys watch the video from here on out. You guys are gonna see the audio gets messed up here and there, but just try to deal with me guys. Make sure you like this video, I'll see you guys after. Okay guys, so it's a spooky night. It's almost Halloween, which means we gotta start stepping up our spook game, okay? So we're here at this place called Dead Man's Castle. The reason they call it it is like here is like the old moat or whatever, I don't really know. But basically this is the way into the castle. We're gonna go explore, but I just wanna show you how we get into this place. Like we're basically breaking in, but you kinda just have to go around this. And if you fall, you might fall to your death because it's just straight rock. So I'm gonna go first, I'm gonna take the camera and then my brother's gonna go. Crap, you good? Good. Hey. Barely not. Yeah, it's just, it's so dark. Okay. Like if you walk up to the wall. Okay, what's up guys? How you guys doing? My name is Brandon Taylor. If you don't know, now you know. It is almost Halloween, which means we gotta up the spook, okay? So basically, we're at this place right now called Dead Man's Castle. If you guys don't know what that is or never heard of it, basically, it's this huge estate that is now abandoned, but one time a man killed himself here and you could still supposedly hear his moans and maybe even see apparitions of him after dark. So what did we do? We came here after dark, which is why it's very hard to see. We're trying out a new camera, we're seeing how things work, but we got here right now and we realized there's not many entrances in. The only thing that we can do is run and leap across this, if you guys can see that, or maybe hop a fence and get in another way. I don't know which one we should do, Jake. What do you think? I think we should climb the fence. Okay, so before we go into this place, I need you guys to do me a favor. I need you guys to hit the subscribe button right now, turn on post notifications so you never miss a post. Also, because I'm about to do something risky that I could possibly die in there because, you know what, who lives here now? Crackheads and homeless people, so I could possibly die. But I'm doing it for you guys. So I need you guys to smash the thumbs up button right now before I go in here, hit the like button. I'm gonna give you three seconds to do so. Three, two, one, boom, you guys hit the like button. So now we're going in here, I'm pretty nervous. Um, I don't really want to clear this gap unless I really have to, so let's find another way in. Here we go. So, oh, is this locked? Do you think this would be the best way to get in? Yeah, I hear some shit. Okay, so we're already hearing shit. We're basically just off the highway into this house. Yeah, house. realistically, we can just like, we can jump up climb, here climb, here. climb. Okay, so I'm gonna try to go first. I just want to say something, guys. Before we go in here, we could run into something in there. Like, I don't, I'm not saying anything paranormal, maybe, but what I am saying is we could run into, like, a tweaker, a crackhead, someone who wants to harm us. So, we gotta be on extra precaution, Jay, because look it. Come over here. This is the only way in. Come check this out. The only way in is to shimmy in. Yeah, but with, I don't know if the ground is safe right there. Maybe we should check to see if around the corner the, the wall is still. This is all metal, dude. I mean, the whole thing is cement right here. Yeah. That's all cement. Well, if you want to go through, go through. All right, so we're going to switch things up a bit and go in a different way. All right, so we're in here right now, and the house is basically falling apart. This looks like this is the backyard. It's... You got to be careful, because as you can see, there's like beer bottles. People come back here. Tweakers come back here. People do drugs in this house, so we have to literally be really careful, because we don't know what we're walking into right now. So let's do this. It's back here. You might just go around. Okay. So basically, we're inside. I mean, I'm gonna 
Sleeping here, to be honest. Yeah, don't sit on my couch. Like, that couch is probably one of the dirtiest things in the world. How much do I have to pay you to sit on it, Jake? <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> I'm trying to think of a number. What people do in here a lot is tag. Like, I guess they come in here and they think this is a good spot to, you know, lay their ink down and whatnot, so. <laughs> <laughs> what? Lay their ink down? Yeah, there's tagging. See that here? Looks like the staircase. This is pretty spooky. Like, how does it get messed up this badly? I don't know, but be careful. Should we try to go up there? If you want to. Someone's in here with us right now. Okay, he's going there, but I, I think there might be someone under this bridge because I keep hearing walking. That was spooky. Okay, guys. So. This is, we're on the other side now, so basically if we needed to get out of here in an emergency, like a killer came in that way, we could technically run and jump that. You could totally make it. Yeah, I'd have to. Just because like I, I care about you guys and I want to give the best content that I could possibly give on YouTube, we're going to go all the way up. We're going to check out the upstairs. So, this, Be careful. This is dangerous. You think this will even hold? Try it. I wouldn't. Watch where you put your hands, too. I don't think this is going to hold. Looks like a quick to those metal rods. Yeah, once you get to the metal rods. You can try pulling yourself up. That might be best. Oh, I thought that was a rock <laughs> and I sunk into it and I got scared as shit. It's a dirty pillow. Let's see the, those muscle gains. Wait, hold on, before you stand on that, let me look at the, what's under. Yeah, the wood's I wouldn't. Like, look at the wood, guys. There's holes. Yeah, I wouldn't stand up there. There's some pretty spooky stuff up here. Like the, the art. So it looks like the staircase. Oh, what the f*** was that? What the f***? Down. All right, so like the art is really weird up here. Like this is pretty sketchy. The floor literally looks like it's gonna break through at any point, so I probably don't want to walk over there. But I'm kind of curious just to see where this ladder goes. So I'm gonna check it out. Okay, so it goes to the top of the roof, but I don't really want to go that far by myself, so I'm kind of scared. Something sounds like it's walking up there. Okay, so we would have come in over there and we would have been completely stuck. This place is super sus. Like this says 927 all day in heaven. And they spelled heaven wrong. <laughs> so that's spooky. out of here and we called the ambulance and like I don't really know what happened next we just said that there was a woman dying in this house so for all we know she could have died Jake and like she could be here still with us I think you, you ripped your pants yep that's part of my ball sack <laughs> <laughs> can I have to wear that okay I'm gonna jump down from here but this whole place literally collapsed on top of it what is this is this? That's weird. Does it go up? Oh, that's where the stairs that I was walking. I was walking those stairs. Yeah, the stairs went around, but why is this like, why is there a hole right here? I don't know. This place is pretty old when I was doing research on this place, so <sighs> for all we know, this could, because 
not too far from here is where the Nazi stuff was. Like the, uh, what, what are they called? The Nazi camp. The Nazi camps. They're not too far from here, guys. So, for all we know, this could have been a Nazi hideout place. So there's just like a lot of neg- Yeah, I don't like that. There's a lot of negative energy in here. Like, you could just feel it. Like, when you're outside, it feels, like, free. And here, you just kind of feel very stuffed up. You feel like everywhere you look, you kind of see something. Or you feel like you see something. Or it feels like something's watching you. Like, you feel very on edge here. And it's actually super spooky. So, we're going to go explore some more around this building. Because you can go under the house. I've never done that. That's actually really scary. Should we? Let's do it. Go that way. This way? Welcome, MTV Cribs. On this episode, we have a nice little balcony to look at the view. Awesome. Oh, we can go under the house. Yeah, I told you. This is the spot to go. I feel like there's someone under there, though. You want to know that's something that you, that you just said? Huh. That might just make you want to go under the house? On this door it says, life is for living, enjoy the ride. Brandon. Don't f*** with me. No, 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 Brandon, 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 Brandon. 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 What? Brandon, let's just, let's just go. What? What? Brandon. Go in front of me, go in front of me. Watch the floor. Brandon, what? Brandon, what? there is something moving. Watch the floor. Brandon. What? When you're talking about the sign, there is something in the corner, like a hand. Don't I'm not even kidding, bro. Hold on. Here, grab the camera. It's still going? Yeah. What did you see? Okay. Did you film it? Yeah, the whole thing was recorded. Okay. What? So. Let's get out of here, Jake. Well, I keep hearing things. You hear? I heard that. <laughs> I heard that. It sounded like chain link fence. Yeah. Go, go. Are we safe here? Or should we get in the car? Okay, no lie. When you're talking about the door, I don't know what you're saying about something like being there behind you, like under your legs. I don't know if the camera can see it. There is like something like a hand going like this, waving. Don't f with me. I swear to God. Oh. And I, at first, I didn't see it, and you see me like, like, I mean, I'm filming the camera, so you can't see me, but I like looked, and then I saw it again, and I was like, Brent, and that just ran. Holy crap! Here, Sorry. film this. Sorry if the, the filming was bad. I just saw something. Let's get in the car and we'll talk about this. If this is true, we're gonna see it on video, guys, because hopefully Jake filmed it. But like, I really hurt my arm. Oh my God. I was looking into the reflection of the mirror <laughs> and I saw two red things and it was like brake lights. I thought it was someone's eyes. Oh my God, don't <laughs> with me. So, supposedly Jake was saying that there's a hand waving. We were hearing things the whole night in there. Under like, us though. Under us, yeah. Like and walking, we, chain fence it. Like, we literally almost went under that building too, Jake. Imagine if we would have went under there. No, I, that's why I was looking. Holy sh**. That's why I was looking and you were about to say something and I was like seeing something under there. It was so weird. I hope we can see it in the video. I really do guys because that place was absolutely terrifying. I honestly... I don't know what else to I say. I think we should watch the footage now and then come back okay, in a second. let's watch it. We're gonna watch the footage. As soon as we go in there, we start getting issues with the audio, which is super weird because it brings me back to when we were in Suicide Forest with Elton and Colby and Jay. Everything was fine. All the audio was perfect. As soon as we got into that forest, the audio went to mayhem. And that's exactly what happened here. There was something very negative in there. I Like I told you guys, like I was literally smelling the smell of sulfur, which is the smell of like a demon nearby. He said he saw a hand, which means something else was there with us. And it didn't show up in camera. It only showed up when Jake saw it. If this video gets 45,000 likes, we'll go in there and we'll play the Ouija board. During and we'll talk to whoever is in there. Yeah, because I don't know about night unless we go with a squad of people because that place was freaky. <sighs> All right, guys, I don't know what to say about this video at all. Like, I just honestly just watched the whole thing for the first time, and I am super freaked out because what the hell is wrong with that audio? Like, I don't get it. My mic works perfectly. I don't understand why I had that much issues with the mic in that place. Like, that was honestly one of the most haunted places I've ever been in. I felt the negativity. It smelled like sulfur. The temperature dropped drastically while I was in there. I don't know how else to explain it, guys. That place was messed up. I don't like that place at all. But that wraps up this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, please, as always, smash the thumbs up button. Join the Taylor family by hitting the subscribe button, turning on post notifications so you never miss a post. I want to give a quick shout out to Rachel right here. Thank you so much for being active on my Twitter and having my notifications on. You are super active, and I love you so much. If you want to become a fan of the vlog, all you have to do is be super active. You guys know what to do. I will see you guys tomorrow. 
let me know what you guys thought about this whole thing. Like, what did you think was going on? Maybe if some of you guys can decode that, let me know in the comments below. I'm seriously curious as to what the hell that was or why that happened. Please let me know. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Peace. So, Brennan, what are we gonna do? What do you mean, what are we gonna do? Did you see the sign? Yeah, it says no trespassing. So let's go. <laughs> Brennan. Come on, let's do this. One more sign, we turn back, okay? All right, there's one more sign. After this next video. <laughs> make sure you guys check out yesterday's video and also make sure you hit that subscribe button right now and turn on post notifications so you never miss a post. Follow me on my other social medias and I'll see you guys tomorrow. Peace out.